Painting with words. Harnessing the power of articles and determiners in descriptive writing. Hello, language enthusiasts. Today we'll delve into a fascinating aspect of English grammar, articles and determiners. These little words might seem simple, but they can add depth and clarity to your writing when used effectively. And we're going to explore exactly that today. How to use articles and determiners to create vivid imagery in your writing. Before we dive into creative writing, let's quickly revisit what articles and determiners are. Articles are a type of determiner and they include a, an, and the. They help define a noun's definiteness. Determiners, on the other hand, are words that modify nouns to clarify them further. They include words like this, that, these, those, my, your, his, her, its, are, their, each, every, certain, any, no, some, and all. They are small but mighty, helping to set the stage for your nouns, giving the reader a clearer picture of your intended meaning. So, how do these tiny words help us paint a more vivid picture? When you're setting a scene or describing a person, place, or thing, articles and determiners can help to specify, emphasize, and give context to the nouns you're discussing. Take for example the sentence, a dog barked at the mailman. Now consider, the angry dog barked at the terrified mailman. Notice how adding determiners, the angry, terrified, made the sentence more specific and evocative. Let's put this into practice. Here's an exercise for you. I'm going to give you a simple sentence and your job is to add articles and determiners to make it more descriptive and vivid. Here's your sentence. Cat sat on wall. Take a moment to think about it. What kind of cat is it? What's the wall like? Remember, there's no right or wrong here. It's all about being creative and using articles and determiners effectively. And there we have it. A crash course in how to use articles and determiners to enhance your descriptive writing. Remember to practice this skill. It will help you add depth, clarity, and precision to your writing. Keep exploring the world of English and continue creating vivid imagery with your words. Until next time, keep practicing and happy writing.